Good evening. Nice to be here again. Um, a very quick update on our Becca's command stand. Um, because I've got sure, a chess match waiting, and also um, more importantly, an evening meal waiting. I've had no evening meal. I actually spent half the well, most of the afternoon to sleep in the chair, just exhaustedly tired. Just can't leave here. There you go. But our figures that we're going to use for our command stand are all prepped and primed and ready to go. So we have got that far at least. Nice figures by Atari actually. There are lots of detail in them. Nice crisp detail which is nice. So that's all the figures prepped and primed and ready to go. So we'll start on them tomorrow. And the stand has its two trees on it. So that's ready. We've also for our Vesta French foot artillery, the artillery pieces have now had two coats of military green paint. So that's them all but done, just a few highlights and pick out the metal work and stuff. Then add the barrels and they're done. Oh, a couple of coats of varnish I guess. So We'll get on with them tomorrow as well, Get them, try and get them finished. Put them on some bases. So that's... Excuse me, where we're at. Um, I hope everybody's keeping well and virus free. And um, doing what is required. Um, I have to say, you know, I have to say quickly before I go. In a curious kind of way, I am um, actually quite enjoying lockdown. You wouldn't think I would. The reason I say that is, and what I mean by that is, don't take it the wrong way. I'm not enjoying the experience of fellow humans dying like flies and all that. That's that's, that's awful. It's just awful. I. Hope this is over as soon as possible. But from a personal point of view, I'm sort of enjoying the experience because it's it's made me get on with the job at hand, which is finishing this project. It's made me do that, which is good. Um, I'm doing things that I wouldn't have otherwise done, like the chess challenge, and um, watch some very, very interesting videos on YouTube. One of them is, or was, about trying to locate the real battle site for the Battle of Hastings, because they reckon if you go with English heritage, on a tour of the battlefield of Battle of Hastings, they actually take you to the places that wasn't where it was. So you pay all that money and they take you to somewhere where it actually wasn't. These group of people that I watched, they reckon it's somewhere else. So that was fascinating to see how they explained themselves as to why they thought it was here and not there. That was fantastic. So it, I think the thing with all of us is we're all going to be locked. We are all locked down, but it's using your t trying to use your time constructively uh, to make the best of it, and you know to get on with things or to learn 
new skills if you can. And, um, try and stay as positive if, as you can. And it's, yeah, it, I, I'm getting on with things and doing things I wouldn't have otherwise got on with. Which has been, which is, from that point of view, it's been a positive thing. But yeah, don't get me wrong, I want to see this over as quick as the next man. Because I just like to go out for a walk or something, you know, or just, or just some normality back in life. Because it's just. It's a scary time. It's a scary time, you know, and it's. Um, I try not to look at the news too much because I mean, the, the, the way the body count is racking up, it, it's truly frightening. I mean, gee whiz. So, my sympathy, my heart goes out to anybody that's lost family members over this. Cause this is not good at all. This is not good. And, uh, truly, truly not good. Um, the sooner they get a handle on this, the better. But I don't know when they'll get a handle on it or how they'll get a handle on it. And I don't think even they know yet. The authorities don't know yet. But anyway, there you go. That's where I'm at with the um, Becker's Command. That's Figures are looking good now. I'll let the primer dry overnight and I'll crack on with them tomorrow. So I'm going to have an evening meal now and have a game of chess. Yeah, so if anybody wants to enter the chess tournament, it doesn't cost you anything. It's free to enter. Just go to the list in the description in my previous video. Pick a machine. Let me know what it is. And you're entered. I will see which machine comes out on top. Totally amazed at last night's game. I was totally amazed. You know, one machine could be so far behind and then turn it around and, and still win with the black pieces as well. I mean, that was just like, you shouldn't be able to do that. But it did. So that was good. A um, couple of machines are front runners now for what people think will win. Kasparov is popular. And also the Radio Shack machine is quite popular. That's interesting. So yeah, whoever wins, anyway, whoever wins um, will get a very decent prize out of this. I, I can tell you for sure. So that's it, that's me done. I'm going to go away and get an evening meal. And um, Becca's, I hope you're on the road to recovery. I hope you're feeling as good as can be after the op. I'm pretty sure from what I gather you've had it now. So hopefully you're on the road to recovery and you'll beat this thing. Oh, I have a few new, one or two new subscribers, I think. So. I'll try and find out exactly who you all are and give you a mention next time round. But you know who you are. So, as always, thanks to everybody for subscribing. Thanks for your comments. Thanks for watching. Lovely community. Nice to be a part of. And I actually, with this community, I feel like I'm part of something, which is nice. It's a really great feeling. I've been made very welcome. I thank you all for it very much. So we'll see you on the next one.